contending with the breach in the keep by quelling the uprising spearheaded by the gluttonous gastropod known as Gome. We re-emerge in Bastion Keep's stronghold and sense something's amiss. Where the Archangel Tyrael once stood is Lieutenant Lavale, who informs. Terrifying noises were coming from the armory, so Tyrael went to investigate. He said if you were to return, I should send you there. The armory? But, oh no, the Black Soulstone. We race to the armory and are met by a harrowing scene. I am losing control! All but Leah, Adria, and Tyriel are destroyed by a wave of destructive power that emanates from the Soul Stone. We are set upon by the terror spawn summoned from the stone itself. Massacring the remnants of terror, we then check on Leah, who appears to be heavily fatigued, but we're unsure if she's hurt. The Soul Stone seems stable now. The demon's rage has been subdued. Yes, but for how long? Our time grows short. We must take this fight to Asmodan. Then we shouldn't waste time discussing it. I will break their battle lines, enter the crater, and end this. Leah then resumes her incantation, holding the demons at bay, lest they escape once more. And it's then we turn to Adria and query, can the war really be ended? The last of the great evils will soon be defeated. What will you do then? This war will never end for me. Even if we defeat all evil forever, I will carry the scars of this nightmare till the end of my days. Hmm. And Leah? I wish Leah could have the life I never had. But in truth, I fear she'll be damned as well. I disagree. We then turn to Tyriel for advice on our next move, and he imparts. Can you feel the keep shuddering? Asmodan's siege weapons. Saving these walls will have meant nothing if they're reduced to rubble. I'll shatter those weapons before that happens. We will not fail you, Seraph. Tell me more of the eternal conflict. Since time immemorial, the forces of heaven and hell fought for control of the sacred world stone. Until the day, it was stolen by renegades and used to forge your world. Since then, the forces of hell became more interested in corrupting mankind than in facing us on the field of battle. They wished to turn humanity into a weapon? They knew that mankind would tip the balance of power forever, and very clearly, you have. What do you know of the creation of our world? To escape the eternal conflict, a group of renegade angels and demons came together and created a hidden paradise for themselves. They called this world Sanctuary. Eventually, they commingled. They gave birth to mankind. That is why you have both good and evil within you, and the power of both realms as your birthright. The power of your Nephilim ancestors was so terrifying to their parents that they tuned the world stone to weaken them. They knew they had loosed something unimaginable upon creation. Tremors in the Stone is a short quest and has already been completed. I thought we would take time before we head into Ariat Crater and speak to some of the citizens in Bastion Keep as a rare opportunity to hear their dialogue. I told you, Marcus. I told you the demons would find a way up from underneath. I heard that hero slaughtered a huge fat one in a larder. I've never eaten anything from there again. Hold on. There he goes. We hear you're heading out onto the battlefields. We'll hold the gates, but I don't think you need us to. We all do our part. Without you, this keep would have fallen before I got here. When this is all over, we should have a family. A what? Children, Drian. We can have children. Th that sounds... wonderful. I, I think I'm needed back on the wall. No. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't come back on purpose at this rate. Let's play Defend the Keep! No. Why not? Because you want me to be the fat demon he killed. Things are looking up, Marta. There's barely anything left to kill. I knew you could do it. 
There are other soldiers about besides me, if you haven't noticed. No, I haven't. And finally, we get to speak to my favorite former mayor, Holus. Now's the time to run, isn't it? While there's a lull in the fighting? I don't know much about fleeing. I'll trust your expertise. Gotta love a good servant of the public. Got their own interests at the forefront till the bitter end. It's then we head towards the Ariat Crater Gate. Bodies litter the path, and we sense our fight with Asmodan will soon come to a head. Bastion's keep stands tall. Now I go to the battlefield, where Asmodan's war machines bombard our scattered soldiers.